Hey everybody, CDROM1019 here. So, um, from this episode forward, uh, there seems to have been a little, little snafu with, uh, with the, the sound recording. I'm not entirely sure what happened, but the, uh, the voiceover volume just came out way too low. And, um, unfortunately I just noticed it while putting all these videos together, um, and I have no concrete way of fixing it entirely. I could try to do the voiceover, or just re-record the voiceover, but it would kind of lose the effect of, of the voiceover I did when I was giving it live. Um, so I'm going to just have to apply some uh, some uh, some vocal enhancer effects through Adobe Audition and then just put it back into Premiere and just get these episodes uploaded to YouTube. Um, so here forward, the vocals are going to be a little low. Um, if uh, I'm gonna I'm gonna do what I can to get them to sound a little bit better, but um, unfortunately, audio engineering software uh, for general consumers is not to the point where the algorithms are so advanced or advanced enough that it can immediately or just efficiently determine a voice from a noise, a sound effect, uh, a musical pitch. Um, there's just, there's just no piece of software that's efficient enough at just 100% isolating vocals from anything else, uh, so that I can edit it and raise the volume. So, uh, you have, uh, you have all my apologies for that. I'm sorry. I'm going to do what I can to fix this and I'm going to do better in the future about making sure that this doesn't happen again. But unfortunately for the rest of the Mario, uh, Paper Mario playthrough, uh, it's going to be this way. Um, like I said, I'm going to apply, apply some effects to try and make it sound better for you guys, and I'll do what I can. Please continue to watch. It only gets more interesting from here on forward. Uh, things get dangerous, and uh, it's really, really cool, so please, please, please watch this to the end. It's really great. Um, I'll do better vocal checks in the future, and uh, thank you very much for watching. So I will see you in the videos. What's up, gamers? Welcome back. Welcome back. Welcome back to the Paper Mario Thousand Year Door Danger Mario Run. It's your boy, CD Run 1019, and it's time to begin the prologue to Chapter 7. So, we last left off, Peach was <coughs> taken to the Thousand Year Door. Uh, Bowser's in Roadport. He's got no crystal stars. He can't find Peach. Probably like time wasn't great. Massiveness. <coughs> Magic Koopa Scouts find a suspicious underground chamber. It isn't even on any real maps. Really suspicious. Emperor's Battalion's attempt to breach the chamber. There is a punchable a scraping tooth and nail. Three one for Bowser.
over now. <coughs> World 3-2, it says. I fell right at home, but where are we now? Look on the buff of Bowser on the wall behind you. <laughs> Could it be a crystal star? Advantage Bowser. The last we found one, but now we'll make it ours. Freeze jumps. <laughs> Tell me you don't know the famous rock hog. Punk wizard can get these muscles. Excuseness. I don't ask me how, but you cleared my secret training facility. Not too shabby. I've ordered some super freaks to level up the difficulty. <laughs> I'm an adorable little weakling. Hi, fella. You ever see a weakling do this? Hey. <laughs> now you're sleeping. I knew you were a weakling. Crystal star? <laughs> He can spoon too! Oh no! Wait, hold the phone. I'm Taylor Bowser. This is just glass. Hey! What the real one that Rington's house has a cold egg in here? Feel the rock. <laughs> I don't know anybody named Gonzalez. Crud, what after flying to get the star? Well, so much for that. <coughs> Meanwhile, back at the plot. <laughs> Mario's coming back in to report on the fabulous success of the press. Their email. <coughs> I know where I'm being held, I'm on the moon. The one in full in space will learn something horrifying in order to resurrect my monsters. The monster spirit, they need my. That's cool, why is your email cut off? Something must have happened. Alright, onward. Let's head to that thousand year door and get the location of that next star. Up 
on the moon lies a base, and in the base lies the final star, the actual crystal star. <laughs> no way, what's wrong, with the, what's wrong with the map? The last crystal star? That ain't right. <laughs> We can do this uh, important thing mission from Frankie. <coughs> oh, pardon me. Looking for something. I can't say exactly what here, but I can tell you in person when on the west side of Roadport. Yes, let's take on Frankie's trouble. <coughs> now is also a great time to visit the bad shop. Looks like we got another email. Real zip toe. What's up, Super Sleuth? Version cover imposter. Big as far as it's on, the six out all the time. It's a biz, but the man alive. I don't need to be in great danger. Mine's being good for me. As far as I'm headed to Toad Town for my next leading role, if you're on an adventure or something, so leave me the line for my flip. You're cool, baby, but I'm cool. Best of luck. <coughs> Alright, we'll come back to uh, Merlin in a little bit. <coughs> for now, let's make use of our new super boots. This treasure, treasure chest has been here this whole time. It's the Ultra Hammer. So then, find the old and way to find the Ultra Hammer is even more powerful. You also can use a new technique. Let's practice it right away. It's the exact same technique as the Super Good to see you, Mario. Definitely save the princess. And be careful on your quest. <laughs> All right, now that we got that, let's check in at the badge shop, see if anything new is on sale. <laughs> All right, we got a simplifier, a power jump, Pretty lucky P, soft stomp, and attack affects P. Um, I don't know what that does. I'm trying to remember if that has anything to do with Gloomtail or not. Um, <coughs> hey, well, let me give me a second to look that one up because that bothers me. I thought that that was a. Uh, I thought that that was a thing where uh, Gloomtail has like a similar weakness to Hooktail. Attack affects P. Pete, right? <coughs> uh, Mario Clip said growls, Bowser's growls play when he uses his hammer. Sound effect is superficial, does not have any mech to Mario. The sound does both effects play one at a time. Um, Alright. Tail does not have any weaknesses. All right. Okay. Well, nothing here we particularly need. So let's head over to the left side. Here's Frankie. Let's talk to him. Turn for Keel Hall. Yeah, I lost my wedding ring. Can't really look for it in front of Francesca, so you gotta find it. I know I lost it after I got back to the airport. Somewhere in time. Alright, let's go find the ring. I believe 
that his wedding ring is back in the World Court dock. I don't believe our friend is back here, is he? He is. So, given that he's going to pay us back in spades, we're going to... We are going to grind for a bunch of money in a second. Uh, let's see... Wedding ring. says Garth's house eastern easternmost area of road tour <coughs> really all the way at that house that's interesting that'd be all the way this way See if I can get to that treasure chest. Um, we have to get there by boat. <laughs> let's uh, let's go out of our way to uh, to go and get that right now. Something over here, actually, now that I think about it. <laughs> what, though? Oh, there's a star piece here. Okay. <laughs> actually, I think I remember what that other dot is. double dip. That's actually pretty handy. Um, I don't know if we'll turn it on right now, but that just lets us use two items of battle and go this side. Yeah. Okay. Well, let's head back and get Frankie's wedding ring. And then we're going to grind for some piazzas uh, because Frankie should give us a platinum card and that will open up a new realm of possibility uh, for uh, items that we can grab. I also just noticed that there's this, uh, that there's a shine spread over there. I really want that, so we're gonna try and hover over there. Um, taking that over it might be a better way. There's also star piece there. There's a star piece on that ceiling. Um, <coughs> all right, I'm gonna try it this way. Because I really want that shine spread. Let's 
talk about what we did wrong here. All we needed to do was, well, was get on this uh, ceiling and uh, just go back here. And there's the shine spray. Alright, wonderful. Now let's uh, just uh, I'm gonna go back on that ceiling because there's uh, I'm gonna get that sign that shine spray that's on that ceiling right there. And then we'll continue. Distance here. I actually didn't really know about this one. Uh, whoops. I kind of missed the mark there. Hang on. I'm curious. Does this do anything? Oh, there's a star piece there. That's nice. Spring hmm. jumping does not do anything. Okay. Let's go back up there because I actually, I really do want that, that shine spray. <coughs> And who is this fellow? Grifty, the traveling minstrel, has been days early. Would <coughs> you like me to share them with you? Coins, or is there a tell you want to hear? Wow, okay. I don't know what I, I don't know what these these stories do, honestly. Um They probably do something. I'm not certain what though. Alright, there's two shine sprites for three. Alright. Let's go get Frankie. Is bring back. Shop again, we've kind of gone around a few places, and uh, our friend is back from his oil expedition, so we can get rid of our coins. I also farmed a little bit for um, some Piantas, uh, just by spending money. <coughs> okay, uh, no, nothing really worth anything in here. The happy flower, maybe, but not much. So let's give Frankie his ring back. Here you go. And now we got ourselves a gold card. Alright, she's he hit it. Frankie's gonna go back to see Francesca. And we're gonna head inside the piazza parlor and see what rewards that unlocked. First we're gonna ask for our piazza back. Alright. And he says that's got a member card on the new area. We can now play the tube game. Uh, let's talk to the real quick. Hey, you. Okay. Let's check the winnings. Okay, we can now get a Power Rush badge. Um, that Actually, that's what I'm looking for right now, isn't it? Yes, it is. Okay, I need a lot of those. And they're 34 uh, Piantas apiece. Um... Camera throw, I got that, I got that, I got that, I got that, I got that. So we just need a couple, of, a lot of power rushes. Um, so we're gonna we're gonna exhaust the rest of our coins to get some uh, more, like a few more piantas here. Okay, cool. How many power rushes can we buy with that? Let's see. <laughs> One. There's three, and we can get one more. There's four. All right, I need about six more of those. So this is where this gets interesting. <laughs> We're going to leave the Pianta Parlor. Now that we've exhausted all of the coins, and we don't really need to spend a lot of money on buying a bunch of different items. Some badges maybe, but not so much on items. <laughs> We're going to go to 
talk to our friend who's going to, as I've said, is going to pay us back in spades. If you don't believe me, watch this. Slumpy, I went to drive to a desert for oil. I, I, I did, I totally struck oil. There were times I was covered in dust, we were ready to give up, but never lost sight of the dream. One day I finally seized it. You believed in me. Thank you so much. I want to return your loan with a little more. Please take this. We've received 999 points. Now you have some capital to start your own venture. Just don't let your dream die. No, you make it someday. All right. So totally paid us back in spades that he gave us 333 coins for every 100 coins we gave him. So we are maxed out on coins right now. And we're going to go on a shopping spree. Because we are very likely to make a decent amount of coins back when we go to the moon. In fact, like the last chapter I made, like a couple hundred. So let's check the bad shop one more time, see if there's anything interesting in here. Uh, the happy flower badge is here. Um, I don't think I need that badge though, so I'm not gonna bother with that. Slowly and automatically restore FP during battle. I'm kinda. Um, that's uh, not really worth the PP. Um, so we need about six more. <clears throat> um, let's see. So we need about six more uh, <clears throat> power rushes. So we're just gonna spend a bunch of coins on this Pianta Exchanger. We got how many? Four with a couple with 119, so we have about 220 or so. So we're 300 coins down already, and we got. Alright, so that means that we can. I'm just thinking, because I kind of want to save a lot of coins, but I, we, should, we should be good. If I keep doing this, we'll have about 200 Piantas. That should be enough for all the Power Rush badges I need. We'll be down to 300 coins too, and that's that's gonna be fine. We don't really need. Honestly, it's it's cool to have all those coins, but we don't really need them uh, for for a whole lot. I mean, we need them to do this. <coughs> um, one more just for safe, just for good measure. All right, let's see how many power rushes we can get with that. We already got four, so let's see. That's five. Six. <coughs> seven. <coughs> eight. Nine. And we got enough for one more. And that's ten. All right, that's about all the splurging we're gonna do for now. <coughs> we're gonna take off. Again, nothing in the bad shop we need right now. I also stored some items away. Um, I might go. In, I'm gonna go into this shop just to grab a life shroom or two. Um, I'm gonna grab one because they're 50 coins each. Um, you know what? One more. Why not? Just for just for good measure. Um, and we still have about 250 coins left over, so we did pretty good. That was our shopping spree. Um, so that, that's about it for that. Um, let's turn a few of those on right now. We've got five badge points to use. So I'll turn on a few of these and save uh, some more badge points for something else that I might need later. Uh, I don't know what that is yet. Most probably he's not turned on. I already had one. Ooh, I gotta sell that badge. Can I sell a badge? I might have bought a close copy when I didn't need it. Let's see if I can go up to the badge shop and sell that badge, because I actually did not need that badge. Only 
one close call P. Hey buddy, how's it going? I'm selling. I would love to sell <coughs> this un unequipped close call P. Where is it? Power rush, power rush, power rush, close call P. There we are. Hey, we made our money back for that for that uh, live stream. Okay. Um, let's see. At this point, that should be plenty of time, um, frankly, to see what's going on. Let's also check the report for that trouble center. See if there's any here. I don't think so. Uh, the only thing is Toodles must have that book. Um, on a book to Jolene. Uh, I don't want to go all the way to Glitzville right now. All right, so <clears throat> that'll do it for the time being. Um, let me think. Ah, let's, uh, let's speak to Merlin and see if we can upgrade some of our partners. We've got three upgrades uh, pending, so let's uh, let's upgrade some of our top fighters. Let's upgrade Yasi again. has a similar attack, but it's just doesn't kind of have the same punch that uh, that Bo did. Um, Alright, and we'll power up uh, Vivian, I guess. Um, I should power up Flurry, quite honestly, but we're not really going to have much use for her, so we're going to power up Vivian because we might be fighting with her here and there. <coughs> Excuse me, and if we get any other uh, Shine Sprites uh, in the next chapter... We'll use them to power up Coops, Flurry, and Ms. Mouse. <laughs> Alright. The heck, what health? Ah, that looked like she had a weird amount of health. Alright. <coughs> okay, that should do it for now. Let's go talk to Franklin. I believe it was hidden for some reason. You'll need the Ultra Hammer. Hey, right on, we already got that. That certainly changes the subject. Use the Ultra Hammer to find the pipe to get to Far Outpost. Alright. One more thing, bombs there, a surly bunch. May not let you use the candy man to negotiate. Good luck. Okay then. With that being said, uh, we still have coins that we can use on stuff. Um, I think we're pretty good at this point. We got all the power rush badges we need. Um, we'll check uh, hell. We'll check the bad shop one more time to see if the inventory changed. <laughs> Thinking it over, we're gonna be we're gonna be on a bit of a journey anyway. Um, and now that I think about it, um, all right, nope, nothing in here that we need. Alright, thinking this over, and because I already know what's gonna happen, we're gonna go accept, um, we're gonna go accept a, uh, the, the Toodles I must have this book trouble, we might as well, she's, she and Jolene are gonna be on the way, in a sort. Uh, so we'll get this. <coughs> Alright, with all that 
done. Let's head to Far Outpost. game's gonna go. I'm, I'm kind of feeling a bit iffy. I'm gonna grab an, another life stream here. Honestly, I might even put that one in storage just so I don't waste it. Um, but we'll see how this goes. I might I end up needing those. Alright, just so happens that the far, the piped far outpost is this way. Here's the pipe. On we go. Keep going until I find a safe slot. <laughs> Stupid Pokemon, let's clear up this ahead. I'm actually gonna go back one second because I just kind of remembered something. <laughs> there's this uh, there's this pipe in here that um, we can use to uh, to get something kind of cool, I think. I don't know what's in the trap chest, but I'm just gonna use this just so I can get that, uh, that item. It's a flower saver! Alright, that's cool. Um, flower saver P, that might come in handy, I may have to equip that. <coughs> we shall see. Keep this up. We're gonna make some really good. We should make some good experience. Uh, I'm trying to see what's going on here. There's appears to be an item block here. There it is. It was a shiny spray block. Glad I found one. <laughs>
be sure to check out all the other videos on the GSL YouTube channel. Check out the official YTR forums. And follow me on twitch.tv slash chaos control channel. I stream every Friday, Saturday, and Sunday. And until the next video, we'll see you guys next time. Take care, folks.